Hello and welcome to tonight's homework help for Monday night, October 22nd, 2012. We're going to jump right in with our homework, multiplying parts. Okay, uh, uh, It's asking us what multiplication problem is modeled. So we have to think how many groups of how many boxes do we have. So we'd be multiplying the groups that we have times how many boxes we have. So you're going to count how many groups you have here and then you're going to count how many boxes you have total and that'll be the multiplication problem that's modeled. Then you're going to write the answer there. Okay, here we're doing the reverse. Model the problem 5 times 31. What is the product? So you're going to put the big part of 30 in here, and 31, and then the small part of 31 down here, and you're going to make five groups of it so that you can figure out what the product is. You're going to have to write your answer there. Okay. Uh, then down here uh, it says uh, multiply the tens and ones place values separately and add the products. Okay, well, uh, I'm going to model this one down here for you. So uh, 79 comes from 70 plus 9. I know that. So 79 has 7 in the tens place, which is 70, and 9 in the ones place, which is 9. And then I'm going to multiply both of those by 4 to figure out my answer. Well, um, an easy way for me is I know 4 times 7 is 28, and then I'll just tack on the 0, so that should be 280. And then I have um, uh, 4 times 9 I know is 36, so now I have 280 plus 36. So when I add those together, I get 316. Okay, let's move on to the back side. Okay, here we are on the back side and we're working on the soccer squad. Okay, here are some members of a soccer squad. Find the players' numbers by solving the number puzzles. Write their numbers in the circles on the backs of their shirts. I'll do uh, one of these for you here. Um, let's do... Uh, let's see here. I'll do number four. Oops do number four here. Half of my number is six. So I know that half of the number I'm talking about equals six. Well I know if I want to get that n alone I multiply both sides by two. The twos cancel to a one and one times n leaves me with n and six times two is twelve. So my number then must be twelve. Okay. Um, so you're going to do the same for all of these problems. Just try to figure out what the number is for the guy in the jersey. Please show your work to get credit. And uh, give us a text or a call if you have any questions, either Mr. Supper or myself. Good night, good luck, and go Bears! Rawr!